Lynn, it's me, Anita Wigglet from RuPaul's Drag Race Down Under. Thank you so much for booking a cameo with me. It's so lovely to record this message for you. Oh, thank you so much for your lovely, lovely words. I'm gutted too that I'm not on Drag Race Down Under anymore. I mean, I was rooting for me to win just quietly. <laughs> I could have done with $30,000 for a nose job, that's for sure, Megan. Oh, thank you so much for saying that I was your favorite, and especially after Snatch Game and my first on Queen's Town Under. Oh, it was a bit naughty, wasn't it? I'm surprised I haven't been taken out by the royal family yet, to be honest. And, oh my gosh, my verse, my dry ass pussy is thinly famous now, which is quite wonderful. Now you ask me if it's Kita and Anita, or Anita and Kita, well, technically it's Kita and Anita. But um, after Snatch Game, maybe it should be Anita and Kita. What do you think? <laughs> um, Kita and I, we actually met and uh, we started drag at the same time. So 10 years ago in New Zealand, we have the club called uh, Family Bar, which is a gay bar in Auckland, the main club. And we started doing drag at the same time. And I met Kita and she was just so lovely and had such a great vibe about her. And I thought, oh, she's just, she's so nice. And I think we could be friends. And then we, we did become friends. I moved back from Canada. I was there for two years. And um, I said, Kita, I think we should do a show called Drag Wars together, which is like an amateur drag comp. And she was into it. And we started working together doing comedy. And then we were lucky enough to buy our first business, the Drag Dinner Theatre Kaluzzi. And then Phoenix, which is a sort of like a, another cabaret theatre space. And um, she's been my best friend for, gosh, five plus years now and she was the best man at my wedding and it's just a genuinely lovely person. Um, you asked me if it was weird being there with her and it was absolutely weird in that we're used to doing things together all the time and for the first time we were uh, individual and judged as being individual but um, she's yeah since the filming she's still my absolute best friend and I hope that we get to come and see you soon maybe the two of us doing something together um, oh thank you so much again for asking me these questions is that are uh, these questions sorry it's been lovely talking to you and I'm sending you all my love thank you and enjoy the rest of the season I mean I know it's not going to be as good because I'm not on it anymore but oh well we'll watch it together and judge shall we <laughs> lots of love to you Megan have the most wonderful day or night love you bye